That'll work, man. If you don't mind, I'll probably reach touch base with you offline after the call and kind of get more details on what's going on. Everything's going pretty good uh, this morning. Talked about making sure uh, last day operations. Talked about them uh, driving home, making sure they stay safe. They need to stay here and take a nap before they head out. I appreciate it, Matt. Let's go uh, D out on 427. So this morning, uh, we'll hold our morning call where I have all my rig managers get on. We uh, discuss anything from operations to safety to SSEs to trainings. After my morning call, it's usually, um, you know, hitting rigs where I'll visit two of them today that are fairly close together. So as a rig superintendent, you now go from a, where you have to stay on a rig 14 days at a time, and then all 14 days. Now I uh, basically work 24 hours a day, seven days a week, whenever, whenever I'm called. But now one of the deal with luxuries is, you know, I get to go home to my family every night. So after I help out where I'm needed, you know, with my h &P family, then I get to go home to my family. And I'll get with the rig manager, we'll discuss what he's got operationally, uh, what safety incidents he may have come up or seen or talked about. What's up, man? Hello. So far, our guys, our drillers, they're pushing the life belts. Yes, sir. By lockout, tag out, been stressing a lot about it. Verifying you do have a key, you do put your lock on your box, and then just continue moving forward that way. And then the permit to work system, make sure we're using our palms. So our actively care, to me, is a huge role in, in what I do. And it's not just a rule that we have to follow to be to have a job with HMB, but it's a culture that we build. Anniversary's actually Thursday. Oh yeah, you got big plans. No, because it's my daughter's birthday also. <laughs> so she took it, huh? Yes, sir. We'll start talking about family life, what he's got going on at home, and just try to to uh, get to know him better and build that relationship between us two. From there, we'll go out to uh, 434. That's really close. We'll hold the conversation with them and kind of go through the same process. You know, talk with my rig manager, make talk to all the guys, make that walk around, just dig it off. Yeah. And so that's what I'm going to push to all the rigs is if we don't need it, if it's something like that we don't have to do, we don't, we can get rid of that hazard. Get rid of it. You got better ideas, we can make it easier for us. Let me know. I'm, well, I'm open yeah. for ideas. Yeah. Everybody's looking for a solution and nobody has one. And that's the closest that we've came. So really good job on that. get home around 4 35 o'clock and then it's my seven kids for me HB is all about family they had a big involvement in me adopting children it took us two years to adopt I adopted the three kids from Ukraine so now I have seven kids at home and still you know it never never missed a paycheck HP was always there, supportive. The family that we have here, everybody's reached out. We've had, I've had people that I hadn't even met reaching out asking for pictures, you know, just updates on the kids, updates on my family. <laughs> you know, when I got this position, when it was asked of me, what makes me successful? And to me, it's my family. I need to make sure that my family's provided for, which makes me and drives me to do a good job here at HP. And so just the, the support, just the, the family setting that HMP has, I'm here, I'm here for good.